Bigeminy is just a term that doctors use when discussing the beats within your normal heart rate. Now that doesn't sound dangerous, right? You might be thinking that bigeminy is nothing serious since the word sounds nice and cute. That is where you are wrong. Bigeminy can turn into a severe case that could lead to heart complications if not treated. But we are not going to let that happen to you. After watching this video, you will be able to identify bigeminy. You will also know its causes, symptoms, treatment, and of course, how to prevent it from happening to you and your loved ones. Hi, how are you? We hope you're having a great day. Welcome to Scope Care, where we talk about health tips and other information to make your lifestyle better, healthier, and happier. For this video, we'll be talking about bigeminy and what it may mean for your heart. Before that, make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell. This way you'll get updated on our future uploads. It would also be nice if you give this video a like and share it with your friends. How can you describe feeling like the skips in your heartbeats are normal? Since there are times that you feel that your heart isn't beating normally, especially when someone you like passes by, well, by watching this video, you will be able to identify which beats are the ones that you should be worried about. So let's not waste any more time and move along to learn all about bigeminy. What is bigeminy and where did this word originate? Bigeminy is a term that is used for unpredictable heartbeats after regular beats. If a heartbeat is normal and healthy, it should produce a synchronized and steady beat pattern, followed by a short pause. However, there are instances when the pauses between the beats turn into another series of long and fast beats. These two unpredictable beats are then seen as twins. That is where the term originated, bi, which means two, and gemini, which is the Latin word for twins. Together, side by side, they gave birth to the term bigeminy. Now the location of the beats is then identified. It is called premature ventricular contractions if it is coming from the ventricles of the heart's lower chamber. On the other hand, it is called premature atrial contractions if it is coming from the atria or the heart's upper chambers. How can you understand whether you are experiencing a PVC or PAC? Well, the expression, my heart skipped a beat, is accurate, and you can feel the sensation of your heart beating faster when the heart is pumping little or no blood to the body. These beats are considered normal and not necessarily diagnosed as bigeminy right away. However, if it is already a continuing issue, you might have to consult your doctor as it is one of the symptoms of bigeminy and might lead to some heart problems. Symptoms of bigeminy. Now, you are the only one who can feel whether your heartbeat is normal or not. There may be times when the PVCs and the PACs you are feeling might not be that noticeable, but one thing is for sure, Continuous rapid heartbeats or sudden skips in your heartbeats are already symptoms of bigeminy. So you have to be aware of how your heart is beating. Is it normally beating every minute or are there instances when you feel like it is gradually skipping beats without a reason or maybe it is beating too fast? Whatever you might be feeling, make sure that you seek medical assistance the moment you think that something is off. Causes of bigeminy. The causes of bigeminy are not always consistent or even the same in every case. It varies from your heart having a complicated electrical system because of heart diseases or increased blood pressure. At the same time, it can be caused by a set of potential triggers like alcoholic beverages, caffeinated drinks, tobacco, asthma medications, and the like, chemical imbalances, anxiety, and or lack of exercise. Whatever the cause of bigeminy, you still have to undergo an assessment with your doctor to identify the cause accurately. Therefore, you will be able to seek proper treatment and at the same time, get advice on how to change your lifestyle to be healthier. Bigeminy Diagnosis We are happy to inform you that diagnosing bigeminy is easy. The main way is by taking an electrocardiogram or EKG test now, you don't have to worry much because it is not painful. You just have to lie down comfortably as your doctor places electronic sensors on your chest to record your heart's electrical activity. 
Once that is done, the results will automatically show if your heart is having irregular beats and identify the source of your heart's unusual rhythm, thus giving the diagnosis of whether what you are experiencing is by Gemini or not. Next, you will undergo an exercise stress test where you will be instructed to walk on a treadmill or ride a stationary bike while being hooked up to an EKG machine. Now, this test will already be the determining factor of how severe your case of bigeminy is. The doctor will observe if your PVCs or PACs disappear during the exercises so that he can decide whether or not your bigeminy is severe. However, if during the stress test you develop other beats, then it can show that you are already on the road to having a severe heart complication, one of which is called arrhythmia and is a very serious heart condition. Lastly, if by chance your stress test showed normal results, but your doctor is still not convinced that what you're experiencing is normal, you will be given a 24-hour monitor called a Holter monitor. Your doctor will recommend you wear this device to catch any PVCs or PACs during the 24-hour observation period. This will be an added confirmation on whether the heartbeats that you are having are regular or not. So now that we have discussed the symptoms, causes, and diagnosis of bigeminy, we hope that we have your full attention because, as you can see, bigeminy is a condition that should be taken seriously. The question is, have you ever had a moment where you've experienced an issue with your heartbeats? Please let us know in the comment section below. Next up is, how can you know whether or not bigeminy is life-threatening? Yes, we meant it when we said earlier that some contractions you feel are regular and harmless, but that does not mean that you should ignore it, especially if it is becoming more common than before. Once this happens, you might be in for more serious heart concerns and need medical assistance. This additional work that your heart has to do by producing these irregular beats can take a toll and lead to heart failure. Also, you have to remind yourself that bigeminy is the leading cause of arrhythmia, which is life-threatening because when the heart is not beating on an orchestrated pattern, it can form a clot. This clot can then escape the heart's chamber and travel all the way up to the brain and lead to a stroke that can be fatal. How can bigeminy be prevented? We know that we mentioned how the causes of bigeminy are usually unknown, but that does not mean that you can't do anything to prevent it. As the saying goes, prevention is better than cure. Now, you know that having bigeminy can result in severe heart disease, and to prevent that, you have to do certain things that can help you maintain a healthy heart. These include following a nutritious diet, exercising daily, quitting smoking, and managing your blood pressure, cholesterol, and blood glucose levels. Also, since bigeminy can be caused by an adrenaline rush, you may need to avoid certain substances that produce adrenaline, such as caffeine and nicotine. Lastly, stress and anxiety can also lead to irregular heartbeat problems. So by doing meditation and relaxation exercises, you can reduce the stress and anxiety you're feeling thus promoting a variety of benefits which includes a healthy heart. And that's all for today's video. We hope that you were able to learn a lot about Bigeminy and actually help you spot it right away. Knowing the symptoms, causes, and diagnosis is definitely essential, as well as information such as if Bigeminy is life-threatening and how to prevent it. Now, before we say our goodbyes, do you have any more thoughts about Bigeminy that you want to share with us? If yes, now is your time to shine. Comment down below any major takeaways you had while watching this video, as well as questions or additional information that you might have about Bigeminy. We would be more than happy to read all about it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell so you'll get updated for our future uploads. Again, this is Scope Care, and we will see you soon in our next video. Thanks for watching.